What we had over the last couple of days is just getting uh, even more hazy going into this weekend because we have that line of Saharan dust. This is the leading edge of it that pushed through this morning. It's made some progress. It's going to be overhead by this afternoon, and you can see it goes all the way back even east of the Bahamas. So we're going to be stuck with this for a while. You saw the camera behind him earlier. It was hazy from the Miami cam. This is Fort Lauderdale. Still can't even see those buildings there in the background. So this haze, we're going to stick with it for a while now. When we say a milky sky, this is what we mean. You see how the sky it looks whitish more than bluish today. So that's what that Saharan dust is going to do. Lowering your air quality too. certainly not helping out with the heat situation. It's what uh, nine o'clock in the morning and we're already at a hundred and two heat index in Homestead feels like 100 in Miami. All of us with a triple digit heat index to start out. So you know it's going to be a hot day. Heat advisory in effect for all of us in South Florida, anywhere south of Lake Okeechobee, all the way down into the Keys at heat index up to 108 today. Yesterday was the third hottest day of the year in terms of the heat index. Today is going to be very similar to that. Chance of rain to cool you down is not all that much. 30, 40% means a lot of us will end up staying dry. A few of us get in on maybe a quick shower or two. Doesn't look like a whole lot. Doesn't look like much in the tropics either. It's been 11 days since our last active tropical system, 20 days since our last name storm, and we don't have anything on the horizon just the way we like it. It is quiet out there, Saharan dust drying out the tropics. For now, there are signs this pattern could change later this month, but we're going to sit back, relax, enjoy the quiet tropics while we got it.